World Series title to the north side and today Cubs team president Theo Epstein announced he is leaving the ball club. Yeah, WGN's Patrick Elwood live outside Wrigley Field with a reaction from fans. What are they saying, Patrick? Mike and Ray, by and large, positive reaction. Sorry to see him go, though. You know, he arrived in town like so many before him, Theo Epstein did, promising that elusive Cubs World Series. Unlike his predecessors, he delivered. And so it's an end of an era and one that Cubs fans will look back on and smile. It was a victory parade like no other. 108 years in the making, and Theo Epstein had made good on his promise after doing the same in Boston. With the Boston Red Sox, he bought a, a World Series with them, and uh, it was great to have him here, you know? The once boy wonder transitioned to experience pro to a season seeing all, done it all vet before the cubby blue fan bases eyes. It's in time and the Chicago Cubs win the World Series. Never cocky, always humble, and deferential to his supporting cast. What makes a great organization is a thousand little sacrifices that mm -hmm. people make when no one's looking. And today, beneath the iconic Wrigley Field marquee, word of his leaving has Cubs fans bidding him a fond farewell. Sadness, he brought a World Series here. I mean, he's absolutely one of the most integral parts of bringing a World Series right here. and. Honestly, if that's his legacy, that's, you know, timeless and such something that's wonderful for us to share. So. so where does the road lead for Epstein? That's unknown to us anyway. Him breaking the curse is, you know, that's that's a that's a measurable. But fan Max could envision Theo forming an ownership group to buy a team. Even bite your tongue, the White Sox, says this longtime Northside follower. Oh, parting may be such sweet sorrow. I don't. It seems he, he's pretty cut and dry about wanting to take a break. But yeah, yeah. I've yeah, seen yeah, a, a couple of people players, maybe hinting at him uh, maybe buying the White Sox when Reinsdorf steps down in a couple of years, which would be terrible. But um, it seems like uh, some some uh, some ownership stake, you know. What I keep hearing over and over again from Cubs fans is wherever Theo lands, just don't go to the St. Louis Cardinals. Mike and Ray, as I throw it back to you in the studio, I think I undersold it a little bit going into the report, so let's do it again, take two. So it's an end of an era and one that Cubs fans will look back and smile <laughs> ever so fondly. You nailed it. You nailed it. Very right nice. There. Very nice. I'm glad you practiced it. <laughs> Thanks, Pat.